for my 1970s birthday party regalia. And my beautiful friend Loretta is turning 70. And here are some of the things that I am going to be wearing. My dress is this color. And here is my afro. I'm excited. So I will be transforming into a different person. And I will let you in on it. So here we go. Okay, I'm ready to start with my makeup. And the first thing I want to do is uh, start with my concealer. Now, I am not a makeup artist. I have in the past sold makeup and did remember some tips. But the first thing I want to do is use my concealer, which I picked up some concealer, and I am not going to try to promote any of these products. The whole video and the whole thing is about my friend Loretta. So if you notice, I have allergy eyes, so I have to try to get rid of all of this darkness, the dark circles around my eyes. And also, let me just let you in. This lighting is terrible. I am in the hotel at the desk when you do at the writing desk, and the light is pointed down. So the lighting is not so good, but that's okay. You'll still be able to see the transformation. I walked out of the house without my makeup. And so all of this makeup is new. Um, oh, look at my eyebrows. I got the eyebrows. I'm excited. So I'm going to put on my concealer and my hair. Uh, so after I do that, I'll show you some more. Okay, now. I'm trying to do a little bit of contouring. I'm gonna do this the way. Like I said, I am not a makeup artist. I do not claim to be a professional. This is home style makeup for a party for my friend's birthday. She is turning 70. And next month I'll be turning, you don't know. <laughs> and I ain't dead. <laughs> I'll tell you later. Next, I'm going to go ahead and put on my foundation. And I forgot the name of this foundation. I think it's Cognac. And I'm hoping that it is the right color because I've not used it before. And I'm hoping that uh, it is a good blend. If not, guess what? We're going to be Cognac. We will be Cognac anyway. When I get that on, I'll see you again soon. Okay, I have my uh, foundation on, and I don't know if you can see, but it's a pretty good foundation, pretty good match. And so the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to put on my eye makeup, and here are my colors. So what should I wear? Back in the day, the blue was really, really popular. So I have some blue eyeshadow. So I think I'm going with the blue because that was the popular one back in the day. All right, so let's try it. I do not have a sponge brush. I wonder why they didn't put a sponge brush in here for my eyeshadow. 
you have to put, try to put it on with my finger. Next thing is I have two different blues. Which one should I use? I think the bottom blue looks more like my nail polish, so I'm gonna use this one. What do you think? Okay. All right, we'll use that one. I'm gonna use my pointer finger. I moved the camera over so that I can see better, so I won't be at the same angle as you are. So here we go. I'm going to put this blue back in. I think I'm going to use my compact instead of trying to look into the phone camera. So let's see what's good. Please no comments about my technique because I am caught without my makeup bag. Can you reach over? <laughs> okay. All right, when I finish this, I'll let you see what it looks like. It's coming along. Okay, I'm about to put some lip liner on. I have my eye makeup on, and I'm not sure if it's going to do like it should, but anyway, it is what it is. I'm going to line my lips, and then I'm going to work on my lips. I'm going to use a bright red lipstick. So here we go. <laughs> All right, so we'll see. I look real bright here. Might have to tone this lip sweet down. Okay, now I have put my wig cap on. And I need to try to get all of these little gray babies behind my ear under my wig. There we go. Yeah. Yeah. It's my we in search of bobby pins to hold these pieces on. This is synthetic hair. I don't know anybody <laughs> that has donated a real afro. <laughs> All right, here we go. We're gonna put it on. Ooh. Now it's time to work with this sister. It's flat on one side. Okay, I'm gonna work with it and we'll see it in a little bit. I'll be back. Okay, here we are. I have my afro on. I have my makeup on. And I am almost ready for the party. 
And so I can't think of anything else that I need to change, but I feel good. And I'm excited about Loretta's birthday party. Maybe I'll meet Charlotte. I want is Charlotte coming? Charlotte, Charlotte won't be there? Okay, well, I'll just have to see Charlotte another time. But anyway, here we go. I'm about to put my dress on and I'll give you some more pictures. Nineteen seventies. Looking good, girl.
this party was outstanding. She had family coming in from Chicago, Ohio, North Carolina, from Texas and other uh, cities. She had people here from California and friends as well, co-workers and new friends as I am. We had a wonderful time shopping, visiting, eating, sharing our experiences, and just loving on each other. I am so glad that I had the opportunity to come to Texas to visit and to celebrate my new friend's birthday. Well, friends and family, this is the end of my video. If you like the content of my videos, please like, share, and by all means, subscribe. I can't hear you. Touch the screen and then touch the mic. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and Ha, ha, ha.